So this is a review of the Cotopaxi Alpa Travel Pack. The, it is 35 liters in capacity, and I'm packing for a three-day business trip. So it has zip opening, suitcase style, a small compartment on this side, and a large one on this side. So what I'm packing with me is a extra pair of shoes. Comes with um, this is the shoe bag that it came with. Into here, all the undergarments and whatever is in this travel pack. Put that in here, and then this can be zipped up. Most of the clothing, since uh, including shirts and so forth, is folded in this travel pack. Let's go to the main main apart compartment. The main compartment has tie down straps, but I'm not going to use it at this point. Because I have TSA pre, so all the toiletry can just stay in this little Alvin um, toiletry bag, which goes on top, and it just kind of fit. One thing I want to show you is, inside here, there's a very small zippered compartment that I'm not using, but I guess you can put valuables in there or something like that. I have a couple of um, small cases for my EDC stuff. This is just pills and whatever, and this is my laptop charger. I'm gonna put them in here. And then this side. On this side, as you can see, there are two small zip compartments here, which I'm not really using. I don't know what they're good for. I guess I can put my wallet in there or something. And the reason why this is half side is because there's another compartment on the outside, which I'll show you in a minute. So I'm going to fold this up and step this up. Now, some of the features, notice that they have this thing where you can put your zipper through. Let's do it the right way. Now, if it's zipper in like this, this little tab catches the slipper. Um, the pull. So if somebody quickly trying to open it, it, they cannot. So it's kind of a security feature. And they have this in every single one of the zipper. So anyway, that's the main compartment. On the outside, the front and the top, there is this other very, very large kind of a dump pocket, which is very useful because when I'm traveling, I want to put things that I need immediately in here on the flight. So both noise cancel has it goes here. A uh, small bag that has all the um, iPhone, iPad charging cable, which I might need. Inside here, again, this is a zip compartment. So when I am going through security, I'll put my phone and my watch in here and just come up a little bit protected. But this area is very, very large, so it can fit a lot more stuff. I'm just not doing that. And because of it, the inside compartment is really the bottom half. Now, Again, the back is very well thought out. There are full handles on all the sides, including the bottom, which makes grabbing it out of overhead bins or trunk um, very easily. On the this side, this zipper is not what you think. It is not a laptop compartment, but what it is is actually opens up into the main compartment inside where we put the clothes. This is really useful. For example, on a flight, uh, on a trip, I needed to get to my aspirin, which is in the EDC bag. So I open this and just grab this out and then get to it. Or this is another place that you can use to um, put your travel coat, for example. And again, you can lock this down if you want to make it a little safer. On the other side is the padded laptop case. So it has a little small part and a thicker part. This small part is too small for even my 13-inch control. Right, so this has to go on to be this part of it, and then you can put the iPad on the inside. Let's zip this up. And let's go back. Finally, the last really cool feature are the backpack straps. So first of all, they're the contour style. So very comfortable. That's a um, adjustable chest strap. 
It comes with waste jack, which I have not used, but you can. And then there's another little um, pouch here as well. But all of the straps can be tucked inside the bag. So if you don't want them to get caught um, inside an overhead bin, for example, on the plane, you can un open these up and then tuck them inside. I don't really need to do that. So I just to save time, I leave them outside. Uh, I had a bunch of little loops here that you can tie things to if you want to. Uh, the material, this is I believe 1000 denier. This is some kind of uh, PU material, uh, TPU material. It's supposed to be water resistant but not waterproof and it comes with a rain cover. 